re-allowed these Native Americans, it overruled the Supreme Court, allowed these Native Americans to be able to ingest their peyote. If they were doing something that was, go ahead. So what was it called? The Religious Freedom Restoration Act. If they would have been doing illegal things up there, if there would have been fights breaking out and violence, if there would have been illegal selling of peyote, that would have been one thing. But because of the history that you mentioned and because the fact that everything was basically clean around peyote, this was, was actually a, a pretty good law by Congress to enforce the First Amendment free exercise. What else have you got um, examples of free exercise? Because we talked about a few. That's the Church of Marijuana. That's the Peyote Native Americans. That's the I Am Faith. Go ahead. Bob Jones University. What's the story with Bob Jones University? Go ahead. If you go to the school, you're not two interracial couples cannot. Two interracial couples. That's how I They can't. A white female and a black dude are not allowed to become a couple. Okay, so basically, Bob Jones, where did they get this from? The Bible. Where in the Bible? The Old Testament. Bob Jones is a fundamentalist, still is, a very fundamentalist Bible college in South Carolina. And they had a policy so that when you as a student went during your orientation, when you went through the application process, you would know this. Number one, they pulled everybody aside and they said, one of our teachings, one of our church teachings based on the Old Testament of the Bible is that indeed you are not going to interracially marry, you are not going to interracially date while you are enrolled here. Um, to come back over to you, if they did interracially, do the white chick and the black dude, if they interracially dated, if they interracially married, while they were at Bob Jones, what would happen to them? They would be expelled. They would be immediately expelled. So what happened in this case? Um, I believe they did get expelled. They did get expelled and they sued. And what was their argument? What was the government's argument against Bob Jones? They said discrimination. They said this is a racist policy not allowing people to date or marry on account of their color. And they said we have the right as the government to come in and stop this policy. Bob Jones said no. Bob Jones said uh, we're using the Bible. The Bible is the majority book of the country. These are our First Amendment free exercise rights. Well, how did the government attack Bob Jones in order to get them to stop this? Tax exemption. They removed their tax exemption. They basically said, if you do not stop this policy, this ban on interracial dating and marriage, then we, number one, are going to revoke your tax exempt policy. And if we, we don't, you know, we may not be able to force you to stop this policy, but we don't have to pay for it. So we're going to revoke this, which means Bob Jones was going to have to come up with a significant amount of money that otherwise they would not have had to do. What did Bob Jones, what, what happened in court? They lost. They lost. Go ahead. Why did they lose? Yeah, why did they lose? What was so important or what was so special about discrimination that was different than faith healing and some of these other things? Anybody? Go ahead. If, tax ex if, the, if, if, if an organization is getting tax-exempt uh, money, then that means that they, they fall under uh, um, the public, so they're not allowed to... Um, to practice anything like that, any kind of discrimination. Okay. He's, he's kind of going to, you know how, I guess, you're kind of referring to like how the Catholic schools do their own thing and they right. don't care about what everyone else right. does because they have their own money. Well, it's going to apply to them because they're getting government funding. So the government's going to have some check over there. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. Basic, go ahead, Ashley. You want to say something? Oh, no. no. Anybody else? Go ahead. Um, well, it's dealing with uh, personal rights. Yeah. <laughs> okay, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, the tune is gone. The tune is gone. The answers dry up. Okay. All right. Here's here's the thing on this. Here's the thing on this. Basically, what they said, and if you remember, I had given you the term a valid secular policy. Secular means non-religious. And basically, what the court held is they said, listen. They said, you know, they're not attacking the Bible. They're not attacking Bob Jones' religious faith. These kinds of things. What they're really doing is they're attacking the discrimination. So by going after the discrimination, it is a valid secular policy for the government to step in and deal with this non-religious policy that just so happens to affect religion in some way. What did Bob Jones do once they lost? Did they cave? No, no they just said, we don't want your tax money. We're just going to pay for everything. Oh, they allowed interracial dating. 
Yeah. Eventually. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, make sure you get all the words out. Okay, just come back to what Benny said before. Benny, you're absolutely right. Bob Jones raised the money. And whether you like their policy or not, basically what they said is the man is not going to hold us down as far as religion is concerned. We're going to raise our money, and then once we raise our money, indeed, we're going to continue with our same teachings as we had. To your point, Michonne, absolutely. Eventually, when Bush was running for re-election, he went to Bob Jones. Shortly thereafter, they rescinded the policy. Are they tax-exempt now? No. Why? They are all privately funded, but why? Because they, they could be tax exempt now since they, they changed the policy, right? Go ahead. They basically said, you know, we understand the power of the government right now, and we are not ever going to give in to the idea that you're going to be able to do this to us again. Um, Bob Jones, it's really hard not to make this a short answer question because there's an awful lot here.